Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, I just got back from playing 18 holes at Terrace Creek, which is sort of like the local course here in the Seattle area. And I thought I'd just start tracking my progress as I just started playing disc golf a couple months ago. Um, and I want to sort of see how I pro progress over the months. Uh, so I definitely have a lot of work on. Uh, my upshots are... Eesh, some you'll see there's a couple shots in here so go easy on me but in the comments if you have any, if you have any tips or tricks or if you played this course before let me know uh, thanks for watching and i'll see you guys at the end all right guys hole one terrace creek gonna throw the river um just try to land it on the hill over there it's super muddy out here so i got my mud boots on let's get it done Well, it's going to be a long putt, but we're on the hill. Ah, far. All right, hole two um, curves around to the left and then up a hill. So I'm going to throw this vandal backhand, try to just at least sit it up on the hill so I have somewhat of a look. Uh, I'm at the base of the hill, but it's going to be a long, it's going to be a long shot. All right, I'm right here. Uh, I got to go all the way up that hill. Uh, it's dangerous because if you roll back, it's uh, not fun. I flick the uh, particle. And that went way off to the right. All right, hole three, right across the ravine. You gotta hit the gap. I'm gonna throw this new bounty. Oh, another bogey. All right, hole, let's see, one, two, all right, hole four. Uh, we're shooting out of the ravine now, and we gotta just straight to the left. Go through the river. Should be good. All right, we're right here. Where are we? Right here. Uh, the hole is right on the other side of the hill, which is right on the other side of that tree. So I'm not going to do anything crazy. I'm just going to try to plant it over there with uh, my judge. Bit of a headwind here. I'm gonna sidearm the uh, the D1. We got a long ways. Left still. my particle at the last hole. I'm gonna have to go back. So for now, we'll just uh, we'll throw the bounty. Next hole hugs the foliage, goes up into the trees there. I like to throw the vandal here. Oh, 
We got a pipe. Parked. Probably one of the better shots I've thrown here. Three, baby. Well, it's sort of a straight shot right in that little pocket there. I think I'm gonna try out uh, the new uh, bounty that I got in that mystery box. there yeah I was hoping to get through this little uh that little right here in this area but it was a little straighter than I thought and we sort of drifted to the right a little bit more um we're gonna have a long putt here but maybe we can make some magic happen You got a, there's the mando bar right there. So I'm gonna do a, try to throw it straight with this D1 and then just get a hard cut to the left. Might have a long putt, a little higher than I wanted to throw it, but we're just planted right in the ground. We have a look through the trees there, a little windy, so I'm gonna try to do a long putt with a particle. Hole nine, I believe, uh, is right over that ridge there. So just need a straight shot, but a lot of uh, trees and whatnot. So I just got to keep it somewhat low. I went to the left. I, I always get so nervous because I don't want to like, I don't want to throw it too hard and go off on the other side because there's like a creek and it's just sticker bushes, but we have a somewhat of a long throw here. Uh, still a little windy. I'm gonna throw this particle, see if I can just, just get it close. I don't wanna go over. So bad. That's so bad. People walking by. All right, now we got a a miracle, a miracle putt for par here. That's not that bad. All right, hole ten. Threw a bunch of trees, hugged to the left, uh, just don't hit the trees. Oh, hit the tree. All right, got another shot. Uh, I don't want to risk missing this little gap, so I'm going to go rat hyzer shot through this gap here, try to come back in. And this is literally what I was excited to get the bounty for is just a straight shot down the corridor there along the pathway. Well, I stayed on the path. Problem is I only went like 30 feet shot, just a little further up.
All right, this hole is my arch nemesis. It's up the hill and then around. The hole's like over here somewhere. So it's an upshot around there. Uh, it came out a lot straighter than I wanted to, but oh well, uh, at least I have a straight right. shot. Just gotta get it right over there. That was not good. Small downhill shot here. It's pretty windy, so I'm gonna I'm gonna flick the rat. It's really windy. Let's see it right in here. There's no chance of a birdie shot. I just have to somehow somehow get it out. Pretty open shot. The hole is right at the off the edge of the hill there, right sort of where the big tree is. Uh, so we just gotta throw this river. Hopefully, not go too far over or under. That's gonna be tough. I landed on the opposite side of the tree that I wanted to. All right, yeah, sweet. Parked it. I'll be another par. This tends to be a difficult, difficult hole for me. It's a pretty long hole. You got to get through this little gap first and then it's a little stretch longer. Um, so I'm going to try throwing that new sapphire I got out of the box and see if I can hit it. Oh, that was perfect to hit that one branch. A tough one. You can see the basket right in here. Um, you do not want to go over this. It just drops off. So I'm just going to try to park it a little bit before the basket with the, uh, the soft judge. Oh my gosh, I just got to look through that tree. I think I'm parked. Yeah, we're right there, baby. Next hole is tucked right in there. So you sort of have to be careful about the power lines. You want to sort of park over there. I'm going to try, try throwing this uh, king that I just got out of that box and see if we can uh, get it close. Uh, I released it a little bit too much on an Anheuser, or a Heiser, I mean, uh, but I think we actually have a look. Should be par though. All right, pretty straight shot. I'm gonna throw the bounty, see if I can uh, at least keep a straight line. Another bogey. Another bogey. Hole 18, a little bit of a win. I don't want to lose any disc here. I'm gonna throw this beast, see if I can throw it a little bit of a, an angle, have it flip up, coast, and then come back in. Wish me luck.
That might be lost. Oh my gosh, guys, I just found my leopard from three weeks ago. Hey. Oh, there she is. All right, definitely out of bounds, so I'll take the uh, penalty to take my drop. I actually found my old disc from my lost like three weeks ago. So we're gonna try to uh, get as close as we can with the, uh, the bounty. Save a bogey at least. gonna be a double bogey hole. Double bogey. Oh my gosh, that last hole was horrendous. Um, but I think it was destiny because I ended up shanking it so badly that I found um, my old leopard that I lost, the first disc that I lost actually on that hole. So it must have been destiny, um, and I'm glad to have this little baby back. But uh, if you watched that entire video, leave a comment saying, Glute Slayer, I watched that whole freaking thing. And I'm going to and I'm gonna comment saying, holy crap, that's awesome. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.